Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So it's the 18th of the month, which means that we have a brand new Dokkan V-Jump scan to break down. Of course, a big shout out to DBS Hype on Twitter for providing us with this leak. And without further ado, let's jump right into it. Now, unfortunately, from what I can tell, there's not a lot of new information in this one, at least not much that we didn't already know about. Like for example, from the top, we have a preview of the new LR Super Boo. There's his SSR to the TUR and finally the LR on the right side. And of course, it's not really a preview because he's already in the game on JP. He dropped this morning. So yeah, like I said, no surprise there. And then if you scroll down a little bit to the left side here, there's a section for the Extreme Z Awakenings of the STR Super Saiyan Go tanks and the, or sorry, uh, AGL Go tanks and the STR Go tanks. And uh, they're also in the game already. So that's not a surprise. But luckily, luckily, tucked away in this bottom right corner here, there is something that I didn't know about, and I'm assuming most people did not know about, and that is what appears to be levels for support memories or support memory levels. Currently, we have link levels, right? But now, apparently, we're going to be able to level up our support memories or basically like give them extreme Z awakenings i guess because you can see uh, over here we have like different colored coins or metals that are kind of like extreme Z awakening coins for units and i guess we can collect them through some kind of event maybe missions not really sure and then uh once you collect enough you can you know upgrade or level up your support memories so the example they used here is the uh, oolong panties one which if I remember correctly, it gives you a 50% drop rate boost, right? So we can assume that if you upgrade it, it's going to be a higher boost. So maybe instead of 50% at level 2, it's 55% or 60%. And then maybe if you can upgrade it further to level 3, it's going to be 70%, 80%, all the way up to like 100% possibly, right? So uh, it's a pretty cool concept. And of course, for the other support memories depending on the effect you can just increase the boost for each one like for example the weiss one instead of giving three key it can give you four key or five key and beyond for uh, category specific ones instead of giving 10 percent attack and defense it can give 15 percent 20 percent so on and so forth so the concept is pretty simple it makes a lot of sense i'm just not sure exactly how we will be able to obtain the medals and uh, how difficult it will be to upgrade the support memories but uh overall i think it's a pretty cool idea i'll be honest i don't actually use my support memories that often but maybe now since they're getting better effects and it's just something new to do i might actually start using them more right so uh yeah that is the new thing we learned from this dokkan v jump scan everything else is old news at this point but this is definitely interesting and uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think about it. Do you care at all about support memory upgrades, support memory levels, or is it just whatever to you? Uh, yeah, guys, that's going to be the video. Once again, a big shout out to DBS Hype on Twitter for the scan. And uh, thank you for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.